What is going on YouTube? Rachel here. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be talking about my jewelry a little bit. I have a collection of chains and stuff that I've been building up in the past few months while doing this channel. Uh, some of them for the channel. Uh, well, let's be honest, they're mostly for the channel when I'm putting on outfits and stuff. But I've just noticed that I've built up a little collection of them and so and that's these uh silver chains that i've been getting stainless steel please excuse my nails we are in quarantine right now and i had to do them myself i haven't done them myself in a while so please forgive that they look a little dusty <laughs> right now but yeah i've been i have a few uh chain necklaces that i'd like to show you guys i'll tell you where i got them from and how much they were and uh, if you're interested, if you like jewelry and stuff, then this is what I've been into in the past few months. Um, so the first one that you're looking at here is one that I, the one that really started it all. And I got this from uh, Spencer's just in the mall. I was just kind of shopping around there. And this one stuck out to me because of the rings that it had at the end. I just like the way they looked they were like kind of big but not too big and um i like this one because uh I, I like the way it hangs i'll show some pictures of what it looks like on my neck and i also like the chain on these because they're sort of um kind of thick ish but not like too heavy and so it, i've worn this necklace a whole lot definitely and um yeah this is the one that started it all and what i like about going to spencer's is you can find stuff like this at a cheaper price but they don't make make like your skin green so spencer's and like hot topic are actually really good for that kind of stuff if you're interested in more maybe emo or goth or kind of scene e-girl type jewelry then you can definitely start start there and find some good pieces. So that's this ne that necklace, the one that started it all. And I still wear it quite a bit, but uh, I love that one. The next one that I got was also from Spencer's. And I got this one for my um, Harley Quinn Birds of Prey video. I'll put a link to that in the description. But this one stuck out to me because it has a lot going on. So what's nice about this one is um, the way it's set up, you have like three different types of chains all, all put together and it makes like this one really cool chain. You have one with like studs on it, which is really dope. And then another one that's like kind of like a thinner chain link um and then one that has like a little bit more space between the chains so um or in the chain links so this one's really dope because when you put it on it has almost like a diamond diamonds dancing effect because it has so much going on and that's why it's pretty cool it also happens to be a choker the only thing about this one is it's hard to get it tight enough to um, really like make it look like a nice, well-fitted choker sometimes. I don't know if my neck is just too skinny or what. Sometimes that's a little difficult, but it's pretty cool for certain looks. The next thing I got is from um, a brand that I have been following for a while. I've talked about this necklace a little bit already. Another choker, um, and it is from Remore Jewelry. That's spelled R-I-M-O-R. And this one is really unique because not only is it a chain, a uh, stainless steel chain, but on the back you have some really lovely freshwater pearls. Let me zoom into this a little bit. This is not from Hot Topic or Spencer's, but it does have a really unique uh, setup to it. And you can see the way they're joined together right there. 
is pretty cool they make it really seamless so that's my sort of like half way uh choker there where it's classy in the back party in the front i like this one because it is very unique and um i've been wearing this one a whole lot um, on my instagram page and stuff like that because i just like the duality and juxtaposition of it so yeah that's my third one my fourth one here I got um, from Personal Fears. That's the name of the brand. And um, I like how they sent it. They put it in a nice little pouch here. So I just keep it in there. I have not gotten the chance to wear this much um, at all, actually. But it is the most straightforward, probably just basic chain that I have. Um, I'll lay it out there. I believe this is the 17 millimeter. I believe this is 17 millimeter. But this one hangs down and kind of hangs out um, lower than my other ones. It's, it's a little bit of a, it's my only one where I have like some good length. The other two, the other two of them I have are chokers. And the other one is kind of like a midway necklace but this is like more of a true necklace that hangs down and i love the way that it's just a simple stainless steel chain there's no nothing to add to it it just is is what it is you know gets to the point and like i said i haven't been able to wear this much unfortunately but I can't wait to wear it because because of its simplicity, I'll be able to really do a lot with it. And so, yeah, it already feels pretty soft in my hands. So I know this is going to feel really good once I wear it. But those are my necklaces. I'm going to kind of lay them out for you there. Got that one. that that's the triple chain one Let me move this over give you a little ASMR there and I mean I have a little bit of a emo side some people say I'm an e-girl so this is how I sort of indulge in that <laughs> but yeah those are my chain necklaces right there for you boom yeah, I have a lot of fun with these in making outfits, and they're just the perfect accessory that goes with my style. One other thing I'd like to add is recently I got a really cool, I've been looking into face masks and stuff, and um, I got this really dope ski mask. It might be a little too hot for this, <laughs> uh, especially in some areas, but if I can find the link to the Etsy store that I got this from, I got it for like 10 bucks on Etsy. And it's actually really soft. Um, and it's a perfect kind of face mask, ski mask for when, you know, when you're out quarantining or do you just want to get some good looks on Instagram? That's this. It's highlighter yellow, really soft. And um, it, it only shows the eyes. So it completely covers the rest of your face, which is what you need with a mask. <laughs> yeah. But I wanted to show that off a little bit because it just came in the mail. I was really excited. But that's it guys if uh, you have any questions on where I got these from and what they're made of and stuff then don't be afraid to comment follow me on my page at glowfit don't forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel I would really appreciate it I hope you guys are getting through quarantine um, just fine what's nice about these is half of these are ordered online so you can still be flying fresh um, of course if you still have money I know some people are a little low on funds right now because they might be unemployed but I hope everyone is getting through this quarantine and this pandemic without going too crazy hopefully this gave you a little bit of entertainment or some aesthetic beauty I don't know but have a great rest of the week you guys and don't forget to subscribe to my channel thank you mm -hmm.